Well, get this. A local 13-year-old at Pinellas Park Middle School is seeing her dream of becoming a writer turning into reality. Natalia Bowden has just had her book, Not My Imagination, published. She joins me along with her publisher, Carlin Housen. Good morning, ladies. Hi, good morning. This is exciting to have you here. This is remarkable at 13 years old to already have a book out, a published book. So tell me, let's start with you. Tell me a little bit, if you can, about kind of the storyline of the book. So Brooklyn, a high schooler, okay. just lost her loved ones. And so she's like socially impacted by that. As her getaway place, which is a field, she notices magic and talking animals called the peculiar, and they help her build up courage and push her out of her comfort zone to make friends again. Like she Wow. Is. So this is pretty deep. Where did you find your inspiration for this? Um, I mean, is this something you had been kind of toying with for a while? I mean... For with me, how my brain works, I'll just be doing something, and then I'll be thinking, Wow, that's a pretty lit idea. Like, I like that. <laughs> and then I'll, like, get, like, yeah. ideas to wrap that up. So, Have you tried to write other books before? I, I did. I, on this website, it's, it's an app. Okay. And you can write, like, books and stuff. I write some fan fictions, which got a thousand, pretty thousand. Like, one got 3,000 right okay. now. And the other has 2,000, two books on that app. So. I'm trying to think of what I was doing at 13. And it was not writing books <laughs> that, and blogs. No, and I not. mean, is she pretty unique kind of to the business? I mean, brag on her a little bit. On she is amazing. From the very first time I met Natalia, I knew that I wanted to work with her. Uh, her dedication to seeing things through and toughing it out, even when there's times where you may get a little writer's block yeah. or you're really not sure which way you want to go. She just kept herself focused throughout yeah, the entire awesome. experience, and I appreciate it. We're that. showing some pictures. You've already done some book signings. You have an event coming up at Barnes & Noble as well. This summer, you're going to go on a little bit of a book tour as well. Mm -hmm. What do you hope people um, take away when they read this this book, and, and what are you looking forward to meeting fans this summer? Yeah. <laughs> so the main point in my book is to let people know that you're not alone mm -hmm. and that mm -hmm. no matter what, there's always somebody who can help you, a trusted adult, a trusted friend, and that's what I want people to get from that, is that don't feel like you always have to be in the shadows, that you can go out to someone and tell them how you feel. Look at you. Again, at 13, I don't know if this is where my brain process was going. <laughs> Definitely not mine at 13. <laughs> so what is your advice for, I mean, do you see that more and more younger students, you know, are, are wanting to kind of have this career path as a writer? I mean, what advice yes. do you have for other students and kids? Yes, I notice that more kids are wanting to be more creative, wanting to tell their story, mm -hmm. whether it be fiction or nonfiction. And my advice to them is to just uh, know that it is dedication. It does take work. Mm -hmm. um, but one once you put in the work and you you know stay dedicated, your dreams can come true. Yeah. Your dreams can come true. So, what is the age range you're thinking for um, for this book? I mean, is it high schoolers? I mean, what's kind of your target audience? They say so. It, like I usually round it up to an age mm -hmm. like number. So, in my opinion, it's like 12 and okay. uh, kind of like a young adult novel, like okay. YA. All right. Well, congratulations. Thank you, Thank you so much. Thank for, you, do, are you working on a second book already? Is there something already oh, down the pipeline? I have ideas. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, there is the, the next book signing, June 15th, again at Barnes & Noble. We'll make sure and put this info on our website as well. Congratulations again. Thank you. Keep us posted because we know big things are ahead for Definitely. This right definitely. <laughs> Thank, Thank you. you.